Hey guys, how's it going? Spudmon 14 here. And we're here with, finally, another episode of Naruto Ninja Storm 2. And, uh, yep. So, a uh, couple things about this LP. Uh, number one, of course, sorry, it's been a while. It seems like I say that for everything, though, so. And the other thing is, well, uh, sorry for uploading it, like, out of order. And, uh, oh, I actually forgot I have something else kind of going right here, so I kind of need to mute something else I was trying to edit, so. There we go. Alright, but anyway... Yeah, sorry I uploaded out of order. Luckily, nothing was really spoiled. And so we can now continue the story from when, like, okay, so in the story I had originally, basically we ended it after the Gara versus Daedra thing. So with that, let me open a can of Orange Crush. Hashtag not sponsored. Ah, oh, yeah, there we go. And yeah, let's get stuff going. Ah, and just like we're back in the LP, we're back in the village. Awesome. Good. You're both here. Team 7 is about to start its next mission. All right, let's eat some ramen. Just kidding. Oh, I need to make sure... Yeah, I don't really bump the table. Actually, let me... Yeah, let me take a few seconds to correct the view. Won't really take too long, and it's probably for the best, so... Yep, yep, yep. Uh, little wonky like usual. Hmm. Maybe I could put the game case itself. Yeah, maybe if I put that like right down here. It'd be about perfect, huh? Uh, let's do this. Sorry, guys. I know it's just like, uh, why doesn't he do this already? But. Well, I want to do it as right as I can, so... I don't know, maybe that's what I should do. Actually... Let's just take this off. And... Booyah! I think that looks good. As long as I don't bump the table, we'll be alright. Okay. What's wrong with your mind? Ooh, that's one, one thing I do like about this LP. I never thought Gara would become Kazakage. I'm a little bit frustrated, but a little bit happy. Yeah. I understand frustrated. Oh, Sakura, Sakura. <laughs> Ding! I cannot take you today, but uh, I understand frustrated, but you're happy too. Uh, yeah, one thing I do love about this LP is that there is actual voice acting. Which means I can take a break and take a drink of this delicious orange crush. Mm. So basically, recap. Because I know it's really, really been a really, 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 really long time. But uh, Naruto has found out that everyone has basically uh, surpassed him as far as rank. And Gara really surpassed him by becoming Kaze Kage, a.k.a head of the sand, the village hidden in the sand, which is basically equivalent to the Hokage of the village hidden in the leaves, and that's, understandably, a huge deal, so, anyway, back to the action, just to catch you guys up, I'll probably be doing a lot more explaining in this video than I normally do, but, eh, anyway. If he's Kazakage, it means everyone's acknowledged him, right? Well, not necessarily everyone, but... He's probably had a really tough time. I think he's always had a tough time. Being a Jin Cherokee will do that to you. Gara did it! He worked and worked and became Kazakage! I can't help but feel happy for him. <laughs> <laughs> That's Naruto. Well then, you better do the same. You can't let Gara outdo you in the hard work department. That's right. Use it for motivation to train, my yeah, man. Yeah, I'm gonna work hard on missions and become Okage in no time. Yeah, that's, that's the spirit. That's one thing about you that hasn't changed at all. 
I should have muted you, Sakura. So let's hurry up and get started on the mission, Kakashi Sensei. All right, let's do it. Right, but first, let's go see the Fifth Hokage and get our next mission. Okay. Let's go see gotcha. Grandma Tsunade. All right. And so basically, like, I'm, I'm sure you guys can tell. And uh, I think this is a good idea for me to mute while I kind of just mosey around the village. But uh, as you can tell, like, uh, you know, uh, canonically, if that makes any sense, this makes sense. Like, okay, because we played the storyline and stuff, we know that Gar has been attacked. And, oh my god, Gar has been attacked. And, oh, by the way, this is our first story record. Uh, if you get a story record, I'll go ahead and read this. If you get a story record, you can choose story view by telling to leave Ninja Mark with a question mark. Or the, uh, what is that called? Apostrophe in the Hokage's room. Story record will appear in various places as you progress through the main story. What is story view? Story view is a menu where you can watch scenes from the main storyline. Each story record lets you see different parts of the story. Oh my gosh. But, uh, <laughs> yeah, what was I saying? Uh, yeah, canonically, this makes sense because, okay, we know, you know, because they changed it to FPS, first person point of view. Uh, we know that all hell has broke loose and Gar has been attacked. Uh, but anyway, I'm going to give a couple of prayers to Jizo uh, on the statue, so to speak, while I, you know, uh, do, while I do this explanation. But yeah, we know Gar has been, you know, attacked in all kinds of effed up, but Naruto and company, you know, word hasn't reached. I mean, don't get me wrong, things are qu kind of quick in the shinobi world, but they're not that quick. I mean, uh, yeah, they still use, uh, letters and stuff. I know I, I don't mean it takes that long. It doesn't take, like, months to get information, but it can take, you know, a brief little while for the intel to trickle down, for like, lack of a better word. But, uh, yeah, I think this is actually something I just thought of, but it's a pretty good idea to kind of mute the main audio while I'm just kind of uh, going through the town because they don't actually say anything. The characters, they don't actually say anything while you're here. Now, one thing I might want to do while I'm thinking of it is you might want to stock up on bentos if you are at this point of the story. Um, why do that? Well, because just trust me, you're going to be away from, well, just trust me, yeah, just, just trust me, just trust me, stock up on, oh, oh, also, by the way, sorry, like, you guys might have noticed that in between, um, you might notice that the real, the amount of money, and that the other items I have, are probably a bit off and um yeah let me explain why well apparently the save file I was using either a I couldn't remember or B uh, <laughs> I forgot which save file I was using cuz I looked for a save file like right after you know the guard fight and for whatever reason on this LP I could not find one for the life of me so now, either that save file still exists, or and I just couldn't think of which profile I put it under for whatever reason. Or, more likely reason, I forgot that I was currently using a save file, which sounds a lot like me. And I simply, like, I don't know, I was showing a friend the game or something like that, and I saved over it. But this time, of course, I've done things differently, and I basically used the save file that no one would, uh, that I would never show off. And that save file is uh, Cramped Lemur. Yeah, weird, I know, right? But uh, I'm even going to, like, show my profile. Yeah, there we go. Cramped Lemur, like, 56. <laughs> I mean, that way, if I show it in video, like, there's no way I'll forget it. So, because normally, of course, I do that kind of stuff. You know, loading and checking a profile. Eh, it's probably best to do that off screen, you know, most of the time. Uh, I may want to buy some more ointments, by the way. Uh, side note, I don't think I've ever talked about this, but if you're short on Rio in this game, 
Power Rice is really good to sell. In fact, I'm just going to sell like 20 of them. Just because we don't really need that many. So, yeah, Power Rice always good to sell. Ninja Tags, eh, you might want to keep some handy for some certain things. But I'll sell like 14 of them. <laughs> Funny how that works out. And there we go. Just like that. We got that. And I think I'll buy the first Ninjutsu reference book. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, that good, that good. And I think I've bought all the tools we can buy up to this point. Uh, but yeah, I'm pretty sure this is the point where we were in the storyline. You know, what's funny is even if it's not, and we were a little past this part, which I don't think we were, but even if we were, uh, not our Tone Ninja Storm 2 needs an update video. Like, regardless, so... What's funny is normally, normally I'm worried about, oh, when I do commentary, it's like, Oh, did I place it right? Did I do this? Did I do that? Well, funny thing about Ninja Storm 2 is just because it's been so long, like, regardless, even if this is just an update video, uh, it doesn't matter that it is an update video. So, uh, okay, and I think we've passed the part about cursed dolls and stuff, so allow me to get past that and oh I accidentally bumped the table so now I need to fix the angle the angle la, 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 la. well this is fun this is like editing 101 man I get to fix the angle twice okay maybe I should keep the remote off the table yeah that's probably a good idea okay Alright, and this is the Cursed Null request, which I think we might have done this, so I'm just going to skip over it. As far as the Cursed Dolls, I'm not really too worried about it, because, yeah, I'll, we'll, we'll do it anyway, so. Not a mission you have to complete, but it's a mission worth doing, I'll say that much, so. Anyway, let's uh, do this. Let's get to this. Okay, and I'm pretty sure I'm pretty sure I remember doing this mission from Konohamaru as well. So um, let's do this mission like really really quickly, and then um, cause uh, yeah, uh, yeah, it's written on the paper. And, uh, yeah, because I'm pretty sure I remember doing this mission as well before, uh, oops. So, I'm going to go up here and grab the soybeans, and then we'll do the Konohamaru mission. Uh, in case you didn't know, and which a lot of you may not know, the characters of Naruto. And I don't really know all of them in detail either. Um, because I think I've explained this before on the LP, but... I only know what I know about Naruto through the games. Yeah, I've never actually watched, you know, all, each, you know, single episode of the anime. Never done it. Never done it. Um, fun, fun fact, one of my friends, uh, Jamie, she introduced me to Naruto through the games, and ever since then, I've loved it. I've loved playing the games, that is. Um... I am watching the anime, like, kind of, well, let me put it this way, I've been watched, I've binged watched parts of the anime, and because of that, I'm up to episode, like, 200 on the original series, so, I'd appreciate it if there's no spoilers and fun on 14 comments, but, uh, if there are spoilers, I really don't care, because I'm gonna watch each episode episode, yes, I'm a southern guy, so I'm going to watch each episode regardless, so, mm. that orange crush, man, that orange crush, alright, but like I said, I'm pretty sure we finished this, so, with that, I'm going to unmute, and we'll get into the real stuff, so, alright, so we got shotgun pill, so, that we passed the mission so yeah and you don't have to do the shot run kill mission but it's a pretty easy mission to do it's really 
Really, the Shot Run mission is, exists only for one reason, and that is a tutorial on the orb list. Like, there's really no other reason. Uh, and I prefer it over ramen now. If you're a beginner, you may actually want to keep ramen because it has that, like, slight chakra recovery. And that can actually help you out in a pinch in battle, so... I would recommend, you know, keeping the ramen, maybe getting rid of one of the defense uh, ninja tools. Uh, but yeah, if you're new to the game and haven't really... Yeah, and at this point you can still be pretty new and do well. I would recommend using ninja tools. Ninja tools are very, very helpful, uh, just in general. So yeah, give ninja tools a try, man. Get used to using them. Uh, but yeah, we'll gather some items here. So there we go, ninja pills. Oh, and Tom Tom's here. What do you got to say, Tom Tom? <laughs> Me too, man. Me too. All right, with that, we can get the mission started, Grandma, finally. We're here to accept our next mission. Yes, finally. Now, what will our mission be? Find out next time on Floodmon 14 LP. No, I'm just kidding. Hmm. Just kidding. So, <laughs> so, what are we supposed to do? Uh, yeah, well... It's about your mission. L Lady Tsunade, terrible news. Uh... Quiet down. What is it? Ooh, this sounds bad. We've just received word that the Sans Kazekage has been taken prisoner by the Akatsuki. Oh, okay. Well, there you go. So, I'm not sure how long it took this news, but, you know, I'm sure it took at least, like, 12 hours or so. What? Nani? Garaspin! Uh, yeah, man. Sad stuff. And Kakashi's just like, oh, here we go. Lady Tsunade. All right, Team Kakashi, I'm assigning you a new mission. All right, what is it? You're to go to the Sand Village at once and find out what's going on there. Gotcha. You're to remain there and follow their orders. Give them any backup they need. Yes, ma'am. Understood. You said okay. Kakashi. We'll leave for the Hidden Sand right away. All right, let's do it, The guys. Hidden Sand is a fair distance away. Make sure to keep up. Now, see, what he's saying there is basically be prepared, a.k.a. by ointments, by bentos. Basically, this is, I can compare it to a Pokemon journey. You know, you want to buy super potions, lemonades, full heals, antidotes, paralyzed heals. You want to stock up in town before you leave. Because once you get out there, you're stranded. So, yeah. You got it. All right. So let's do that before we leave. Let's take our own advice. And everyone's saying everything on the screen right now, so... Yeah, I think even Sakura or somebody said we have to prepare carefully. Uh, yes, take that advice. Do not... Do not, uh... You know, not prepare, so to speak. And by all means, save. Save, save, save. Save points are your friends. So, let's get some ointments from the item shop, because I think I forgot to do that earlier. And I think we'll make sure we have ten ointments. Alright, so, bye. Yeah, we'll make sure we have ten ointments. That should last us pretty good. And, yeah. Thank you very much. No, no, no. Thank you. Alright, and out we go. I don't really have much to explain on this next part, so we'll just kind of keep hopping and see what we find. I think I might have told you guys, but there is a reason I keep searching all these. Didn't I tell you guys? I think I told you guys why. Pretty sure I told you guys, so. Uh, yeah, anyway. Let's see. On we move. I think I want to play a visit to the Leaf Village cafeteria, actually. Uh, let's see, because I paid a visit in there. I think I want to come in here. Get some, uh, yeah. Step right up. Step right up. Alright. Yes, yeah, some stir fried veggie bentos. Oh, uh, let's buy four of those. Because those, those are pretty good. Uh, yeah. Thanks. Ah, thank you, my friend. Thank you. Uh, so yeah, with that, let's head on out of town. Oh, there's actually a request here. But let's do it after the mission. Shall we? Yeah.
I know we're going to be out of town for a while, but I'm ready to get some parts of this mission going, man. It's been a while. I don't want to just do the investigation and stuff, man. I want to do some actual missions, man. And you know this, man. But I, I am really, really, really excited to get back into Ninja Storm 2. And I hope you guys are as well. So, uh, by the way, uh, if you like this video so far, we haven't really done much except just kind of update and catch up to where we were. But if you do, you know, be sure to like the video, you know, subscribe, stay tuned for more, and uh, yeah, all that good stuff. Now, with this mission, you're finally free, because uh, at this point, it's still kind of tutorial level, so you haven't really been allowed to go to the right of the Leaf Village, but with this mission, you finally are, so, uh, but with that, check everything. Check, 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 discount, double check everything. And by, by everything, I mean, I mean investigate, so that, what, well, that's what we'll be doing. I guess I can pick something to talk about here. Uh, number one, the Akatsuki. Who are these guys? I mean, really. I mean, don't get me wrong, every storyline needs a villain, or, you know, a, like a, you know, rare hunters, for example. Um, these guys, I don't really know who, and if you're playing the wrong and never played Ninja Storm 1, you might not know who they are either. But who are they, really? I mean, hmm, I don't know, I guess we'll find out. Mm hmm? Tamari. What are you doing here? Yeah, that, uh, Sakura, for once I'm not gonna mute you. That's a relevant question. My business at the Hidden Leaf is finished. I'm just on my way home to the sand. Okay, now if you remember, she was in town to help uh, Shikamaru with the tuning exams. Uh, yeah, so... You look like you're in a hurry. Yeah, we are. And obviously, since she's caught in between towns, she hasn't heard the news, and thus was not in a hurry herself to get back to her village. We... we have something to tell you. Yeah, I hate to tell you this, but, uh... Your main man's been got. Long story short. That's the nicest way I can say it. What? Girl was... Yeah, he was got. He was got. Yes. Unfortunately. Ugh. How could this happen? I... <laughs> you and me both, sister. I'm wondering. We're just on our way to the sand to save Gara. Yep. Tamari, would you come along? Uh... How thoughtful are you, Sakura? Yes, of course I'll go with you. Oh, okay. And just like that, we have a temporary team member. It's so. still quite a ways to the hidden sand. Let's hurry. Right on. So, yeah, at this point, gather allies and find out in resources and work as a team. That's what ninjas do. Right. Yes, sir. All right, so at this point, Tamari's going to temporarily tag along with this. So, oh, wait, did I? I think I went back the wrong way. I think I did. Yeah, I did. Whoops. Oh, well. Uh, yeah, by the way, places like that, you can also investigate. It looks like you can't, you know, because they're out of bounds, but, uh, yeah, you can actually investigate places that are, you know, kind of high. And places like that, you can investigate multiple times, so, yeah, kind of weird, but, uh, some of this you just get used to after playing a while. But if you're new, hey, you know, don't worry if you skip something, or, like, like I even skipped that one mission earlier. Don't worry too much, man. I mean... Are we at the Hidden Sand Village yet? Just enjoy the storyline and have fun. Naruto, you're pushing yourself too hard. If you keep this up, you'll burn out. And time to start muting Sakura. Ding! I can't take this anymore! Wow. Uh, okay. Huh? Oh, sorry. There you go, Sakura. I know what Gara and me... Uh, I don't, uh, I've never heard the story in my life. Explain. You know too, don't you, Sakura? Uh, she does? Oh, okay. The Akatsuki's come after me before, for the nine-tailed fox sealed inside of me. Oh, the what's come after you for what? 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 What's happening? <laughs> By the way, guys, like, I think I've explained in other LPs, but anytime I do that, I'm just kind of quote-unquote playing along. 
you know, just in case you're new to the story or the LP, and, hey, I gotta account for everybody, and, hey, maybe I don't really know what's going on, because, hey, it's been a while since I played this part of the story, okay? Sue me, man. Sue me. If you don't like it, you know, unsubscribe, or... <laughs> <laughs> Okay, Sakura. Okay, time to mute you. Ding! Whoa, what Dara is that? We both have monsters locked up inside of us. That's what these bastards are after! Wait, so ordinary human beings have monsters locked up inside of them. I'm sensing a Yu-Gi-Oh reference. You know, anybody remember Season 5? Kisara, Blue Eyes White Dragon, Kara, Amun Ba, Ta, Tusa, and they're like fusing their Ba with their Ka and stuff. Yeah, anybody remember Karim? Yeah, remember how he had like a Curse of Dragon? That was freaking cool. Anyway. And that's the worst part about it! Whoa. Hey, what's with, the, uh, with all the like shadowy figures? I'm sensing a hint of evil in this picture. Are you? I definitely am. To them, we're just monsters. All they see is the means to an end! Whoa, this story's getting deep. And I mean the good kind of deep. Naruto. Oh, sorry, forgot to meet you, Sakura. Ding! Everything about us was exactly the same. No one ever understanding us. I can relate. See, at this point, this is the point of the story where Naruto gets really, really good. And where basically anybody who's ever been through bullying or anything like that can relate. So, yeah, enjoy the story. I'm going to shut up now. But I had Iruka sensei and friends who were there for me. They really saved me. Fend for himself a lot longer than I ever did. Ah, oh, that poor kid, man. And now he's a target of the Akatsuki, just like they targeted me. All right, so who's these Akatsuki again? I'm starting not to like them. I don't think we should like them. I'm not liking them. It's not fair. Why should his life be so full of misery all the time? Why is it always him? You know, Naruto, I don't know, but sometimes terrible things happen to good people. Like, you know what I mean? Like, I'm sure someone in life can relate to that, right? Like, you're just generally a good person, you know, you do things for others, you're caring, kind, considerate, compassionate, and all that, and yet somehow, miserable things, all of a sudden, like a string of them, all in a row, just bam, 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 right after the other, they start happening to you. Why is that? I don't know. I don't know. It's 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 a very, it's a very strange thing. Life is a very strange thing. Random comment, but anyway. That's why I gotta hurry. I don't have a second to waste. Ah, okay. It's all right. We understand how you feel. Yeah, yeah, I do, man. That's why I want to get there as fast as I can. I want to save Gara now. Gotcha. I know. I know too. Thank you, Naruto Uzumaki. Hmm. For your kind words, sir. Well said. We're heading straight for the hidden sand. No breaks. Uh, sir, yes, sir. Hoorah! Come on, let's go. Hoorah! Am I gonna start saying that after every time Naruto gives like a rousing speech? I think I am. Uh, okay. Alright, now these things right here, doesn't look like you can break them, but you can. And, oh, I think I just went the wrong way. Uh, should I save here? Nah, nah let's keep going. Uh, what time are we at? 29 minutes? We should be good, so. But I probably should stop around 40 minutes or so. But yeah, sorry guys if it stops in the middle of the recording. Uh, if it does, just know that I'll go back to that save point we were just at. And that, that will be the end of the episode, yeah. So, yeah, this one has gone on quite a while. We got a memory crystal there, which is good. 
but I don't think we'll see any, like, major fights, which is, eh, you know, is what it is, but at least, hey, we got back into the story. What's weird is that, uh, <laughs> it feels like it's been a while since I've done this LP, and it has, but the strangest thing is, is that we're still, believe it or not, we're still in, like, chapter one, like, the beginning parts of the story, and that, that is just, uh... I don't know, it's very, uh, it, it's, uh, <laughs> nice text from Naruto there, but, uh, yeah, I'm actually going to save at this save point, you know, on screen with you guys, so, yeah, if anything happens, you know, I'll just, uh, end the video there, and I'll know that we saved at that save point, so, yeah, it's so weird that we are at the beginning, like, stages of this LP, man. It's just like, oh, that is, oh, I feel so bad, but at the same time, you know, I'm doing this storyline along with you guys, so, and as patient as you all have been, um, and everything, like, I still enjoy this storyline, uh, and it's epic, it, it really is epic, uh, it doesn't deserve to be treated the way I'm treating it, but... Uh, yeah, why am I saying all this? I don't know, I don't know, but, but yeah, it's very strange to think that this is only the beginning, and yet, like, that first fight, that first fight with Gara and, uh, you know, that one guy who we don't really know anything about yet, you know, with the kind of, the blonde hair that kind of, you know, tilts, and he uses, like, bombs or something weird, something that's bomb-ish, anyway. Yeah, uh, it's so weird that, oh, and behold, we see a statue of something here. Ah, spoilers? Yeah, spoilers, potentially. Um, not gonna say what that is, but, uh, yeah, just, just know that there's something. There's, like, a monument there in the hidden sand. That's, that's all you need to know. Uh, but yeah, um, uh, by the way, to use your maps here, you see how... Like, there's an arrow pointing up. Well, that actually shows you the way out of the sand village, which is actually very, very helpful. Um, like, generally, you just use the arrow to follow where you need to go. And that's pretty helpful in this game. Um, yeah, because as you've seen, like, even though I've played it a couple times, very easy to um, get lost in this game. Ah, oh, we got an Chivo. Nothing escapes you. You can't escape my poison. Once my poison seeps in, it's over. Tamari and Shinobi from the Hidden Leaf Village. What's happened to Gara? Yes, inform us, sir. Well, Next time. The details. For now, we just need to get you to the Kazekage's mansion. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. gotcha. Oh wow, I, I like called that next line. That's hilarious. All right, so we accomplished that mission. Go to the Sand Village. You got anything else to say? Baki has more details. Okay. So from here, we have actually arrived at the village hidden in the sand. Yes, we're finally here. And so, believe it or not, we got ten rocks off. I think this would be a great point to end the episode. Um, I know we didn't get much like accomplished in the way of fights and things like that. But, uh, yeah, I'm gonna wrap things up here, and, uh, yeah, that will do it, guys. Um, yeah, sorry there's no major fights or anything, but, but hey, like I said, we're still in the beginning stages of the game, and with that, we will end things here at, with Naruto Ninja Storm 2, the LP. Uh, thank you all for joining me, uh, once again, uh, just a reminder, if you like the video, be sure to like it. Uh, let me know what you think about the series overall. Uh, uh, yeah, feel free to ask me any questions. I will answer them to the best of my ability. Because I, as I've told you guys for sure, I've not watched like all the battles of Naruto and everything about the story. But as far as gameplay, I will answer what I am able to without spoilers. Uh, yeah. Uh, what am I trying to say here? I think I'm trying to say goodbye. Yeah, goodbye. 
and I will see you all next time. Have a good day. <sighs> Man, it feels good to get back to this LP. Mm. Mm. Oh, boy. Okay. I can get up from this computer chair now. Shinobi, we do. Oh man, that is so spoilerific. I don't think we'll get to, the, to that until like part 260. Oh boy. Mm. Mm. Uh, I did stop the recording, right? Oh man, I didn't. <sighs> I'm gonna have to edit that out, Josh. Cut it out. Get to the cutting room floor. If you don't know. I'll show you some more. Boo, ya boo. <laughs> oh man, I love this game so much. Oh boy, okay, now I'm gonna hit the stop button.